Hey guys, welcome back to Clownfish TV. This is Neon. I am here with Geeky Sparkles. Hello. And uh, lo and behold, another day, another anime voice actor being canceled by Twitter. Oh, surprise. Uh, for politics, of course. Of course. Is there we're... anything else in this world to talk about? No, apparently not. Not when you're on Twitter. Mm -mm. Not when you're on Twitter. So we're going to talk about this again. Uh, yesterday, it was James Arnold Taylor who was being canceled because he was on Parlor and he was accidentally, accidentally liking the wrong things on Parlor. And according to Mark Hamill, he shouldn't have been on Parlor anyway. Right, because you know. How dare you? It's, you shouldn't be on alt. You shouldn't be on alt sites unless it's Twitter and it's alt left. Right, and uh, so I gotta give a hat to that to Sky Warrior who tagged us in on this that uh, voice actress Karen Strassman is hated for liking Trump tweets. So basically what they're doing is they're going around finding anybody with cloud at all or any kind of, you know, Hollywood connections or platform. And they're trying to check and make sure that you are only agreeing with their opinion. And if you are not agreeing with their viewpoint or opinion, that you need to be canceled or bullied into accepting only their opinion. Um, so they're taking her agency and voice away. Yes, they are. And again, this is another uh, voice actress who has been in the industry for decades. I mean, if you look at her... A list of credits. Holy crap. Uh, oh my this, god. This is just as a voice actress. She's also done live action. She's done commercial. She's done It Goes On. Oh, video games and movies. And on. And on. She's best known for like Persona and uh, Bleach. But look at all these games and voiceover. Holy, that is a Disneyland. long list. She's, she works with Disney. She, uh, she did. She now, did. That, now that we're going for the totally diverse and inclusive Disney, she might not. I mean, this is insane. I don't think I've ever... I mean, I've seen some voice actors that have a lot of credits, but this is just like every, pretty much every show you can think of, uh, She's she's been on in some capacity. And she's been doing this for a long time, you know. Um, and uh, it's, it, you know, to go back to why is this happening? Uh, there has been a call ever since the election. Mm -hmm that anyone who is uh, found guilty of supporting or voting for Donald Trump is going to be outed and persecuted and, and flogged publicly. Let um, me say it again. This is America. And in America, you have a right to vote for who you want to vote for. If you want to vote for Donald Duck, you can vote for Donald Duck. If you want to vote for, you know, your pet hamster Squeaky, you're allowed to vote for your pet hamster Squeaky. If you want to vote for Donald Trump, you can vote for Donald Trump. If you want to vote for Biden, you can vote for Harris. I mean, Biden. But you're allowed to do whatever you want to do. Um, and that's the way the country works. You should not have to worry about that if you don't vote the right way. Or you don't like what people like AOC and company think that you will be publicly, they'll, be, they'll try to publicly, you know, basically put you in the stocks yeah. until you, till you change your ways. I'm like, this is a scary and very dangerous um, precedent to set. Yeah. And it's, it's going into hyperdrive on Twitter. And of course, it's hitting the cartoon community first, the animation community first, because the cartoon and animation community on Twitter, a lot of those people are batshit crazy. Oh my God, I can't, you're, yeah. They are. It's, they are. As other people have been finding out recently, and yeah. it suddenly it's a new idea that these people are batshit crazy. Yeah, we've uh, we've been following this for years. Geeky has taken her lumps from uh, some very, very uh, put out uh, Shira fans for years. You're not allowed to criticize anything about mm -hmm. any cartoon show that that the uh, Tumblr slash Twitter audience finds uh, to their liking. You're just not. Yeah, because they can't understand that it's not a personal attack on them. It, they, they, if you don't like it, you don't like me. And it's like, that's just stupid. But it, yes. it's the same kind of thing we're seeing on with this, this kind of thing. If you don't, if you vote in a way that I don't like, and it goes down to this narrative of the media spinning too, that the media has people so um, divided that it's no longer just, you know, it's not even about the truth anymore. It's not even about what people represent. It's about whatever they have told people they represent. Like it's not even necessarily the truth. And I'm talking on both sides. Yeah. Yeah. So this is on uh, what is it? San, San Kaku Complex. Uh, via Sky Warrior, thanks for sending this. Persona and Bleach voice actress Karen Strassman hated for liking Trump tweets. 
Um, so yeah, she is a legendary English voice actor. Of course, we saw her resume. It's mm-hmm. ridiculous. Uh, she's done a lot of uh, a lot of voice acting work over the last few decades. Uh, she's been despised for liking tear-inducing tweets scribed by worse than Hitler President Donald Trump. But she's been she's Rouge the Bat in Sonic. Uh, she's resident. I just, I, I just worse than Hitler President Donald Trump. Yes. And it's like they do understand that you know. Um, I mean, I don't like Donald Trump. I don't really like Biden either, but they do understand that, you know, the way that the making lists and trying to put people in the stocks and haul them out and, and eliminate any kind of thought against what you think or, you know, that that is that kind of is more of a Yahtzee, a Yahtzee thing. thing. That is a Yahtzee thing. But of course, you know, it always always starts with one uh, outraged Twitter user and then they start pouring through. And again, it's not enough to. Uh, not retweet anymore. Now they're going through your like history. And because she was guilty of liking a couple of Trump tweets, uh, she is now going to be canceled. Um, you know, we saw this happen with Kirstie Alley too, but she came right out and said, Hey, I'm a Trump supporter. But they're going to go through and look for any reason to call attention to it because in their minds on Twitter, they've got the power to end your career. Mm-hmm. You know, and right. well, I think they do. I don't they think, think they, they, they do. don't do not have that power. I mean, look, uh, you know, so this person put it out there at first. Um, like clockwork, others of the same belligerent contingent were eager to virtue signal by demonstrating how much they despise Strassman for daring to like tweets from the evil orange man. Uh, this person, fuck, 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 fuck. GD, why do all the people I like have to be shitheads? Because you're on Twitter, because and because you Twitter. let them, you let the, the people on Twitter uh, tell you what's what, whether it's true or not. People need to learn to separate an artist from their art. You can be fine with the voicing she did in the past, but it goes without saying that you shouldn't be supporting her from here forwards. Well, what was the person's name up there? Go back up, Sergeant Marcus Shave Balls. This is coming. You have to listen. To Marcus shaved balls because uh, they are a sergeant. That means that they're an authority figure with shaved balls. That's right. Uh, you have to listen. Oh, look, the worst voice in both games sucks as a person. Surprise. We know th- we know how this works. Been on the receiving end of it more times yeah. than can uh, Yeah, these people are insane. I always knew she was a piece of shit, but effing geez, lady, how shittier can you? Oh, yeah, white. Everything's you know, not great. To be fair, though, to be fair, oh yeah, white. To be fair, when I read these lo- these load of shit tweets, I immediately you know judge these people because I'm like, oh yeah, Twitter. Pretty so, much. You know, I mean, we've gotten to that point where you know, so you say Twitter, I already know they're full of shit. It's like, oh god, you all look the, the same anymore. It's like everybody just see a bunch of like stupid little Tumblr cartoon avatars. It's like, here it comes, here it comes, guys. But I thought that if you had if you had avatar, if you had like anime or cartoon avatars that made you alt right. Yeah, that was one journalist said that you you need to Jeffy. look for Jeffy, Jeffy the journalist. Jeffy the journalist once said, and I, I forget, but it was some Texas paper said that uh, you you would know alt right accounts, bot accounts by their anime avatars. Mm-hmm. Um, but so these for, are all there's a lot of alt right accounts in here. Yes. <laughs> so. Finally, a reason to never start playing Persona. It's sad. Just said the audio. Yeah, I, would, I agree with that. It is sad. This whole thing is very sad. Pain. I could have lived without this knowledge. Suddenly feeling vindicated, my feelings when I played. Uh, yes, Who cares? I was felt as Strassman was vastly inferior. Okay, pain, well, pain. That you can, You do not have the right to tell this person who she can like and who she can vote for any more than they have the right to tell you who you can like and who you can vote for. You are allowed to vote for who you want and like who you want and think what you want, but so is she. No, and you're not. N- and no, and neither one should be brought up as a you know a, on a list for wrong think. And I don't, and if they came out and said that they were doing it on the opposite side, I'd be calling it out too because it's really bullshit. You're basically trying to bully people with threats to make sure they vote the way you do and the way you want. I'm like, grow the hell up. She went full Karen. Wait. <laughs> Too late. I think Twitter uh, too already late. Well, Twitter's acting like Karen. Can't have anything in this house. So yeah, I mean, this is look, this is what's gonna happen. We thought uh naively, I thought naively, that after the election, that if Biden won, that uh, people would maybe calm down. Oh, I didn't think that was gonna happen. And uh we would we would just move on as a to give a mouse a cookie. 
with these people it's like now that we that we now we have the power and it, they literally you, when you look at it, you know objectively now that we have the power we're going to put all of you people who we don't like on a list to punish you i'm like if you okay flip this around if 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 if, if people who voted for trump said Okay, if Trump had won and said, oh, we still don't know who won, honestly. And said, well, now that we have power, we're putting all of you on a list to punish you and publicly humiliate you. Would, you know, do you think that would get the same reaction? Because it's wrong either way. Uh, yeah, it is wrong. Wrong I mean, is wrong. This is insane. I can't believe this is America currently. Well, no, it's 2020. But, I mean, this is literally, we've got, the fact that we've got actual supposed politicians calling for blacklists of individuals who supported Trump. And of course, Twitter is going to run with that. And they're going to be like, we're going to, our little corner here is cartoons and comics and anime. So we're going to go blacklist these people too. And they, they will, they'll kick up a firestorm. There will be articles written. Uh, these people probably wind up losing their jobs because we've literally had people at some companies on Twitter say, anybody that voted for Trump, that comes out as a Trump supporter, liked anything Trump, whatever, you're not working for us. I don't right. want to work with you. And, and, you and it's ridiculous. And and it's, it's not okay. And like I said, I don't care if you voted for Trump or if you voted for Biden. If you voted for your pet hamster squeaky, I don't care. You should not be put on a list just because you didn't vote the way that a bunch of bullies want you to vote. And like I said, I would say the same thing if people were bullying people who voted for Biden. It's not okay. It's not okay no matter what you do because people have the right to vote in this country. That's what really makes our country so great. And now you're trying to basically bully the right to vote away from people. That is a problem. Yeah, this is uh, this is going to escalate, guys. I think what's going to happen is the Twitter outrage mob, because they're so addicted to canceling people, they're going to go from person to person, account to account, and see who's liking what. And... Uh, I'm sorry, I'm just horrified by this headline. Jack Black does the WAP dances. Oh WAP my. dance. No, uh, that's no. No. And Boy, someone's with for attention. No one wants to see that. Is anyway. Is his career really that that? I don't know. Long? If you're going to start uh, a list, start a list against that. Anyway. <laughs> anyway. So, yeah. I mean, we've got uh, two voice actors, two different days. I think this is going to be a daily thing. I think they're going to, Twitter's going to go through. If you're a, a voice actor, you work in comics, you work in animation. It's anything. If you work in the media, if you work in anything, you better have the same opinions as us because we're trying to control the voice of everything and the voice of anybody who has a voice. We are trying to take that away and be only our voice so that, that people, you know, just go the way we want them to go. And the problem with that is that only one one type of person, one type of voice ever gets heard. And yeah. that, that's, you know, for people that's that go point. on about diversity and inclusion, um, they sure as hell don't really actually want diversity and inclusion. And they, and I love this, and I brought this up before, the she shows and stuff too. These people are like so quick to call everybody names, to 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 go and, and blast people and, and hate on them. And these are the same people who are like, I love my show because it's about the power of love and friendship. It, it, no, it's not, because these people act like tyrants. Well, I think people are going to get sick of it. And if that does happen, I think... People already are sick of it. They're just in their own little echo Twitter chambers. If that does happen, I think I think we're going to win in the end. <laughs> uh, so anyway. Yay. Uh, yeah. So guys, look for this. This is going to be an almost daily occurrence, I think, until people realize that uh, if you spend all your time being outraged and looking for people to cancel, eventually they will come for you. They they'll always do. Cancel, they'll start canceling each other. Mm -hmm. uh, we've seen you, it. Yeah, we've seen it. So just wait. It's going to be really interesting in the next couple months. Uh -huh. All right. So we're going to wrap it up. Yep. Okay. So please subscribe for more pop culture news, views, and rants. And we'll talk to you guys later. Bye.